I'm well aware that Nanny Agatha's birthday is coming up. She doesn't deserve my presence, nor does she deserve my grandchild's presence. That day falls on a Sunday. I want to spend it with him, and that's it. Mom, come on, we gotta start getting along in this family. It's Nanny's birthday. If we missed your birthday, God forbid, it would be World War II. World War Three. I am 115% sure that she had something to do with my boyfriend's death. Ma, come on, do you hear yourself? Nanny Agatha's not capable of something like that. Or at, le at least I refuse to believe that she is. And that kid was half your age that you were dating, all right? You don't know if he was in a gang. You don't know what his life looked like. So let's, let's try to keep the peace. Let's try to keep the accusations at a minimum. And let's just try to move on from things. I have you and I have my grandson. That is the only family that I need. She's dead to me. Think about the baby. Think about Junior, all right? How many pictures is he gonna have of Nanny Agatha and her birth dates and stuff? Nanny Agatha's old, you know? We're not in the position to be like holding things against her. She's got her views, she's set in her ways. Can we just like be mature for once? How about this? How about the day that Miranda treats me with respect? I'll treat my mother with respect. Did you make this whole conversation about my ex-wife? It always goes back to Miranda. Just chill with that, okay? Let's. Please, I, I really want to turn a new leaf or whatever the phrase is. I, I want us to all just get along. Nanny Agatha's old. We're not skipping her birthday. Always double standards.